Hello everyone, welcome to Boxing Blocks and guys and please if you're new to the channel make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe button right now and also go to the notification bell icon click it and select all so in terms of opinion bank a new exclusive video you will definitely be notified to my and job brothers and sisters that go to the make sure to like the video share subscribe because sharing is caring and the more you share the video the more other people they know about the channel the more ninja box and african boxes they grow the more you put our name for map for the boxing world for sure now team pulev are trying to sue ready here and anthony joshua you know what i mean um according to team pulev they said that uh, joshua is contemplating skipping corrupt <laughs> I love you, Japanese man. So, uh, Gozev told Press Box PR and says that something. What? Well, I think right here. He said that something that they have always contemplated at their hand, but that door will be closed with a lawsuit if they break our deal and our contract. There are some very good attorneys in England and some very fair courts. So it will count. It will come down to whether they want to decide um, whether they want that or not. I do believe AJ and his promoter will do the right thing and do as they say and finalize the deal through blood, sweat, and tears. Kubrat hand his position to challenge AJ. Will they overrule his rights? Can they all overrule his rights? That's entirely up to them if they want to try that. They should respect the rules of the IBF. There is a signed agreement. Kuba Pulev's team is saying that Joshua has contemplated many times to pull out of the you know the scheduled scheduled bout so or the potential about because we don't know when it's gonna happen yet it is a little bit strange because joshua has never pulled out of a fight except maybe once when he when he when he when he he, he got he sustained an injury even joshua fought uh he fought uh Pert king when he was not 100 percent fit he was not 100 physically fit he was very healed at that time but still when i when i had to fight Alexander Perkin, a guy who is definitely more dangerous than Kubapulev. So how the hell do you think Joshua want to pull out of Kubapulev bout? I don't just see it. I think these guys are just like, you know, they're just trying to say something to make, I, I, I don't know, man, what's the take on this type job? I mean, I want to use some harsh words right now, but as a box analyst and as a guy that, of course, doesn't want to criticize fighters too much. Was a take on this uh, statement from Team Pulev saying that they are going to sue Eddie Hearn and Joshua if they don't obey or abide to the agreement that they had. Well, Pulev's team, um, if we're going to be honest, I don't think they understand um, the position that they're in because if they did they'll know that they are just you know the I, I can't even give them the opportunity to say the B side they the C side and all of this you know it's whatever Anthony Joshua says goes <laughs> right, let me just be honest if they want to make their money they should just keep quiet and, and and let Joshua do what he has to do because you have to you have to think a fighter all these fighters you think they'll make a billion dollars in their fight nope they'll never half of them probably won't even reach a million dollars i don't think kuba Pulev has even seen a million dollars since he's fought uh since he's fought because <laughs> you have to be honest there's sometimes if you're not if you're not the a side if you don't make fans you're not gonna see a million dollars no matter who it is you know, if it, if it, if it I, Teofimo Lopez, you know, he's lucky he's seen that money because he hasn't, he, he himself hasn't even seen a million dollars till 
until his fight, you know, with Lomachenko. Lomachenko give money out of his pocket for Teofimo Lopez. So, the Cuba Pulev team, they should really, really consider just being quiet and letting Joshua handle what he has to do. Because he's the one giving you the money. He, you're the one making money off of him. He's not making any money off of you. You know, he absolutely is not making money off of you whatsoever. He's not making any money off your people. He's not making any money off the promoters or anybody. He is literally giving you money out of his pocket to you. Is what Pulev and anybody listening that's a Pulev fan needs to understand. You know, AJ's bringing in the fans. AJ's bringing in the crowd. AJ's bringing everything you can imagine that, that has to do with boxing. You know, even though if you want to watch him lose, you're still, you're still paying to watch him lose. He's still bringing in the money. So I, 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 I don't think Hubert Pulev understands the position he's in. He blessed Andrew Ruiz. You play your game smart and he will bless you too. Why do you, call, why do you think he's called the landlord for a reason? <laughs> Come on, think about it. I was in an argument with uh, with somebody. I, I don't even think they were a boxing fan. They thought Tyson. They, they said Tyson Fury is is called the landlord. I had to I had to tell them I, I don't think you watch boxing. Tyson Fury has never been called the landlord. You know, he doesn't bring in money. He does he doesn't bring in as much money as AJ. AJ is an international superstar. You know, so even if even where Pulev lived, they know who AJ is. You know, the guy is just an international fame. But when it comes to that, he's, he's called the landlord for a reason. So you, you play your game right and you will be paid handsomely. Much like how Andy Ruiz pay, gets paid. That's what I'm going to hand it. Thanks, brother. It is very important um, that you say that. And you said it all, bro. You said you said it all. Joshua is the landlord, but at the same time, I don't think Joshua will pull out from a puller fight. Maybe okay, he ain't has plans of Joshua Fury happening, but we still don't know how it's gonna how it's gonna play out here. See what go what goes on. Bro. I don't think Joshua pulls out. And for those of you guys who are watching right now, let me share, subscribe. As usual, we give you guys nothing but bangers. Team bless, guys. Peace.